The first highlight for me um, has been seeing the Lendrick Muir staff and volunteer team grow. At the start of the year, we set this as our uh, number one priority to grow, both in teamwork, how we work together, and in our relationship with God to grow in our faith. And we've just really seen that happen. Seen new members of staff join the team who get it. Um, we've got amazing volunteers that are so committed to the work here. And that sense that as a team, we're more than just the sum of our parts. Um, we are able, hopefully, to serve our guests better. So I hope if you come and visit in 2018, you will experience a really, really warm welcome from the great team that we have here at Lendrick Muir. The second highlight to share is some of the improvements we've made to the facilities here at Lendrick Muir. Um, I'm sat here in the drawing room in Mubri, and we've got a new carpet. We've got some new furniture. We've uh, installed a wood-burning stove, which provides a lovely, warm focal point, uh, a welcome, especially in winter. Um, if we go upstairs from here, there's new uh, bathrooms, uh, new en suites on some of the bedrooms, and we're just consistently trying to improve the standard of what we have. And um, one of the things that became apparent to us was that we needed to pressurise the water system because it's all very well having a great looking shower. If what comes out of it's just a trickle, that's no good. So I thought we'd come outside and I'm going to go and show you one of the best improvements we've made this year. But just stopping by to show you some of the new signage that we've got, uh, making it easier to both find the site and navigate around the site. And uh, we've also installed flood lighting on the building just to help, especially in winter, people see the building when it's dark outside and give the place a warmer atmosphere. But we're going to carry on and I'm going to show you uh, the cotter. And I bet you're wondering what a cotter is, so I think we better go down there and find out. So here we are in the cotter, a Finnish barbecue house, something like that, and I'm enjoying the nice warm fire on a cold winter's day. We've been really blessed this year with generous support for the Lendrick Muir Development Appeal, including a generous grant from the Swinton Patterson Trust, uh, which made this cotter possible. Uh, our vision behind this is that it's a place, particularly in winter, where it provides a bit of shelter from the elements around, and groups can come in here, can enjoy some marshmallows, can enjoy the warmth of the fire, uh, maybe enjoy some songs, whatever, and uh, just make the most of Lendrick Muir all year round. The final improvement to share with you is actually a virtual one. We're really happy with the new website we've got and some of the content we're putting on it, like this video and other videos. Uh, we've got a great Facebook page, so there's ways you can keep in touch with us during the year and see what's happening here. And in January, uh, coming up, we're hoping to implement our new booking system, which we really believe is just going to make the whole process of booking the centre much smoother and easier for you. The third highlight to share with you is just um, how groups are using the centre, which is what it's all about. Um, it's so encouraging to see thousands of children and young people coming here each year. We had over 60 school residentials this year. Holidays were packed in the summer and we hosted Soul Survivor for the third time and had nearly 1,300 people here uh, praising Jesus, which is so, so exciting for us. Um, the feedback we get about the unique combination of fun activities, um, making new friendships, having delicious food, and of course as a Christian centre, people growing in their faith or discovering the Christian faith for the first time. This is what is really exciting for us and really motivates us, us as a team. So that's some of our highlights of 2017. We hope to see you next year.